Hello everybody, I'm GP, welcome to Freeride Quebec. So today, this is a little bike check I'm gonna do. Um, so this is still my 2018 uh, 27.5 Capra. So as you guys know, I'm now the proud owner of an Evil the Reconning. So it's gonna be my main bike for 2020. Still, I've got the Capra. Uh, I wanted to sell it, but it's not the kind of bike that still holds a lot of value. But for me, I just love 27.5 bikes, so I'm gonna keep that one. And if you like the content, please subscribe and let's see what's going on. So, first of all, drivetrain. Decided to change the 32th gear for 34th. Decided to fit the colors as well. Uh, I changed the Atlas pedal for DT. Uh, these are the cat one. Um, the Atlas were good pedal, but I think for 250 bucks they're not that great, honestly. Uh, I had an axle that had problems, so it sucks a bit. Uh, wheel set, still the same, still my carbon wheels. Uh, decided to change the Maxxis tire to the Michelin this year, so these are the Wild Enduro. Rear, the rear of course and the front back there. I'm just curious to see how they ride. I had a great commentary about them last year so I'm gonna try them. Still uh, GX drivetrain, all good. Uh, I kept my rotor but I decided to change the, um, the Hope for some SRAM code RSC. I know it seems like a set decision and you might be right uh, but the Hope V3 Tech 4 just went onto the um, and to the evil, since it's gonna be the bike I'm gonna be riding the most. So they were coming with the bike. I'm not saying I'm gonna keep them. Um, still a Fox transfer, a little bling bling from Wolf to here. Uh, one major change is here is that I changed my chuck back to air. Uh, some of you might remember that I had um, a super deluxe coil uh, with that bike. Uh, back this winter, I wasn't sure if I wanted to keep the, the Capra, so I decided to sell a few parts from it. The coil was one of them. Uh, but since I'm keeping them, keeping it, uh, I decided to change the, the stock air can for a Magneg. Uh, some of you might say that it is um, a shit upgrade, and you might be right. Um, quick uh, story, the Magneg is basically to give more of a progressive feeling to a linear bike, and since the Capra is pretty progressive as well, um, some might argue that it's gonna ba make the bike feel shitty, and you might be right. What I did basically was install the magnet can with as much uh, band as I could, and it's um, it's four. So basically, the stock chamber is 64% bigger than the regular one compared to zero uh, zero band, which give I think 211 percent more. So with this little change, what I'm gonna have is a bit more uh, small bomb sensitivity without affecting too much um, the rest of the travel. Um, the problem with putting Magneg on these kind of products of bike is that you're gonna feel much more the mid and ending stroke. But with four band, I think I'm gonna have something cool. So. We'll see how it performs. As for the cockpit, I changed the rental bar for DT1. Uh, we're just curious to change, curious to see how different carbon feel. So just gonna cut it, it's still uh, pretty large. I think it's uh, 800 millimeters or 810. So we'll see with that. Then um, the chalk is new. It's the brand new uh, Lyric Ultimate 2021 with uh, the brand new, um, what's that, air shaft? That's it, with the brand new air shaft. Um, it's supposed to keep the fork higher in the travel, so we'll see what's going on with this. Decided to get rid of the MRP ramp control, which is not a bad upgrade, it's just almost pointless, honestly. And the only upgrade that I don't have yet, it's the um, push HC97, um, damper upgrade, which basically add more clicks. Um, I know that Rock Chalk to have more of a, a less is more kind of uh, mantra, and it's okay. But as for the high speed damper, I mean, you have like four clicks of adjustment, which pretty much sucks. I mean, 
you always ride it like full open or you're pretty much in between clicks so that should be a nice upgrade for the lyrics so and too much guard at the front this little one should help for not having mods in your eyes so that's pretty much it guys so hope you did like this quick bike upgrade so as you might know this is my second bike main bike will be the evil one so can't wait to try them both on the trail so see you in the next episode of free ride quebec guys see you